Hello and welcome back to TW 2016. I'm here with my 2016 save. This is my second time recording it because the first time I recorded it, guess what? My mic somehow got turned off, so I'm re-recording. I mean, I only got up to about here, so after that, I don't know... Actually, I got up to here. After that, I don't know the grades of what happened, so let's go. Um, that's actually better than last time by one whole point. Shane and Stephanie are in the ring to start off Monday Night Raw. Shane says, tonight we have a great night of action, but before we... Ha that we have some announcements to get to about WWE Battleground. The, and Stephanie goes on to say, the main event of Battleground will be Bulletproof's AJ Styles, Kenny Omega, and Finn Balor taking on the Roman Empire's Roman Reigns, Carl Anderson, and Luke Gallows. Shane then says, also, at WWE Battleground, we will have Dean Ambrose versus the winner of a battle royal that will take place this week on SmackDown. Non-title match, obviously, but hey, it's, it's an opportunity at the WWE World Champion. Not the title, but an opportunity at him, so, eh. Stephanie then says, so let's get started tonight with the Young Bucks versus Carl Anderson and Doc Gallows. Well, Luke Gallows. I keep saying Doc, but whatever. Um, Anderson and Gallows have to, they win, mainly because, you know, hey, Young Bucks just came up, but Anderson and Gallows are in a main event of, a pa of the upcoming pay-per-view, so that trumps being new. Anderson and Gallows win. Um, cuts into a hype um, graphic for the main event tonight of Raw as Dean Ambrose and Damian Sandow. Um, all right, good. John Cena, U.S. Open Challenge. Da -da -da -da! The champ is here. You want some? Come get some. Um, U.S. Open Challenge. I'm not writing the corny ass mess that he would say. And it's accepted by Cesaro. And. Him and Cesaro have a good match. They have a good match. Um, this is actually a point worse than what it was last on the first time that I tried to record this. So let's continue on. This is a point worse, but still good, excellent, good job, John. Good job, John Cena. After the match, John Cena grabs the mic. Tyler Breeze, if I'm still the United States champion, oh, whatever. If I'm still the United States champion at Battleground. I will hold a Tyler Breeze U.S. Open Challenge, and you better be there, kid. But no matter what, I'm going to beat you. Because I've proven time and time again I can beat you. But you've never, but you've proven that you can't beat the champ. Because the champ is here! Oh, John Cena. Um, New Day cut a good promo. Yay! Once again, I reiterate, I am not writing for New Day because I am... I would not do them justice. And they have a better match than I expected from the Social Outcasts. Good, good. One thing, um, yeah. I'm, I'm happy with all their ratings, except for maybe Vodalis, but eh. And then after the match, the Dudley Boys attack, um, New Day. Um, eh. Yeah. That's about the grade that I got last time, I think. And this is better. This is like five points better than what I did last time. But as I, I was explaining this last time, this is where I got, like, um, realized my mic wasn't on. That Enzo Amore and Colin Cassie, the real money is them talking. So this is just an attack from Blake and Murphy. So I think the real money is going to, for this feud, is going to come from these two on the mic. Anyway, let's continue on. Kurt grabs a mic at Money in the Bank. Sammy, I wasn't on my game, a game. I wasn't focused, but tonight, I am 100% focused on beating you, and at Battleground, I'm focused on becoming the Intercontinental Champion. So Kurt Angle goes on, has a great match with Sami Zayn. I This may be better than their pay-per-view match. In a good match, Kurt Angle defeated Sami Zayn when Sami Zayn was disqualified when Kevin Owens ran in and attacked Kurt Angle. Um, yeah, and then I imagine, after, I didn't make this an angle on its own, I just had a promo, because Owens kind of cut a promo, but... He also takes out Sammy as well. Alright. Afterwards, Owens grabs a mic. Oh, you're focused now, Kurt. Well, guess what? I'm focused too. I'm focused on winning. I mean, look at me. I'm the Intercontinental Champion and Mr. Money in the Bank. I could cash in tonight after the main event and become your new world champion. I am the best wrestler this company has to offer. And Kurt, you're a washed up has-been. And Sammy... You're a never was and never will be. And I, Kevin Owens, will be world champion. And I, Kevin Owens, am the intercontinental champion. So, I had that last part because I realized that that's not a great way to end a promo, so I just continued on. But, Kevin Owens, um, yeah. 
Kevin Owens with a great promo. Okay. A better match than I was expecting. I was expecting like a 50-something, but a 64 tag team match and had decent wrestling but little heat. Becky Lynch and Sasha Banks defeated Paige and Talia Sky when Becky Lynch defeated Talia Sky by a pinfall with the hard knocks. In terms of in-ring work, Becky Lynch was heads and shoulders above everyone else. Yeah, that's what I expect. Becky Lynch is pretty good. Becky Lynch is pretty good. But after the match, I yeah, I should, probably should have just left it at the match for the feuds. But after the match, Talia and Paige attacked Sasha and Becky. Eh, lay them out. Eh. Oh, Bray Wyatt. I pray, praise be to the Bray Wyatt promos. Zack Ryder on SmackDown. You and me, man. We will finally meet face to face. And there, I is and there is where I will tell you the secret that you need to know to be successful here. But the question is, man, will you listen to what I have to say? Or will you shun me like all the others? I guess only time will tell. Run! Bray Wyatt cryptically saying, I, I know the secret to success here. Yay. Um, this was better than I expected. Kenny Omega defeats Jimmy Uso with the... Um, Kreutz Wrath or whatever, however you pronounce that. But Kenny Omega, debut his debut match, he wins against Jimmy Uso. Not not a not a good match. Um, not a completely horrible match either. But eh, it's not even it's not decent either. So I guess it's more in the bad range. But whatever. All right, after the match, AJ Styles comes in and him and Kenny Omega. I forgot to add Omega to the segment, but whatever. Omega and AJ beat down Jimmy Uso. Eh. And the main event match, Dean Ambrose defeats Damian Sandow with the dirty deeds. Oh, thank God. Okay, rating 100. After the match, Roman comes down and tries to attack Ra A Ambrose, but Styles, Balor, and Omega come out to make the save to end the show. And let's see what the show got. An 84. I have had a str string of good shows. A string of good shows. Kenny Omega was used too much. Eh, he'll he'll get used, and eh, he'll be get he'll get better. He'll get better. Um, I don't know if there's anything to be said here about anything I'm signing. Anyone I'm signing. I mean, I signed a ton of indie wrestlers to de developmental contracts. Oh yeah, this guy. I'm this I'm this guy's here now. Good, 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 good. Let's get him a picture. Let's get him a picture. There we are. Rey Mysterio is now back in the WWE. Um, let's see here. What else? John Cena opinion. Damian Sando talks well. Roman Reigns opinion. Murphy has poor in-ring psychology. <laughs> Look who's fucking talking. Look who's fucking talking, Roman. Um, Shinsuke Nakamura wants to be up on the main roster. In due time, Shinsuke. In, in due time. Um, I th um, let's see here. Is there, let's check storyline heat. Um, Becky and Paige, yeah, that's not good. Enzo and Cass is not great feud with Buddy Blake with Murphy and Blake. Um, Kurt Angle and Sammy and Kevin Owens feud is doing good. The Roman Empire bulletproof feud is doing all right. Roman Ambrose doing great. Um, Ryder Wyatt is doing good thanks to Bray Wyatt's promos. Shane O'Mac and Steph is doing good. And Talia and Sasha Banks doing... Is that doing better than Becky and Paige? Yeah, that is. And Tyler Breeze and John Cena feud going going strong. So, um, yeah. Um, let's check... The, I wanted to check the U.S. title prestige. Oh, man. Oh, man. John Cena. John Cena! John Cena's bringing the prestige of that belt up. Anyway, thanks so much for watching this episode. Actually, before I, before I go into the spiel, if you like this episode, leave a comment, subscribe, thanks so much if you do, and if you don't, thanks so much for watching anyway. I will see you guys next time.